Former Tippecanoe County Judge Loretta Rush is now the first female Chief Justice of Indiana's Supreme Court. She was officially sworn in today during a ceremony attended by some of her predecessors. News 18's Kelly Roberts brings us inside the historic ceremony. I'm Loretta H. Rush. You solemnly swear. You solemnly swear. In a historic ceremony Monday, Justice Loretta Rush was sworn in as Indiana Supreme Court Chief Justice. She's now the first female to hold that position. <laughs> Governor Mike Pence acknowledged the historic nature, but says it is so much more that brought Rush to this day. That I will uphold the Constitution of the United States and the Constitution of the State of Indiana. And the Constitution of the State of Indiana. As her unanimous selection by the Judicial Nominating Commission attested, Loretta Rush has been selected among an extraordinarily talented group of candidates because, quite simply, she was the best choice. Prior to being named a justice in 2012, Rush was Tippecanoe Superior Three Court Judge for 14 years. Those giving remarks were eager to point out our new Chief Justice is Hoosier through and through. She brings an enormous breadth of Hoosier background to the task. And her life experiences uniquely equipped her for the new responsibilities she faces. In my almost two years on this court, and 30 years as a Hoosier lawyer and trial judge, I've learned that the strength of our Supreme Court is based on the collective work and wisdom of the five justices. The ceremony was held inside the Supreme Court Law Library at the State House. Rush requested it host the occasion. This magnificent room, further drives home our branch of government's core purpose to administer fair, impartial, effective justice to the cases we decide while always respecting the rule of law, which is represented symbolically by these books. At the end of the historic ceremony, Chief Justice Rush was ready to do just one thing. Let's get back to work. In Indianapolis, Kelly Roberts, News 18.